I now have four sprites, one for each of the directions of my player. The two original ones that I just mirrored. And then I took the liberty of making an up and down. Very high quality, as you can see here. Now for our object Pac-Man, we have our directional code here. Maximize this. Uh, for A, D, W, and S. And what we're looking to do is change the sprite today. And that is straight out of the sprite index on the docs2 uh, for changing it, giving it a different sprite. So that's what we do to make it change sprite is when I hit the A key, I want to make it look like it's going left. When I hit the D key, make it look like it's going right and actually go in the direction of zero, which is to the right. And six speed. By the way, the directional thing looks like this, right? Zero is to the right, 90 is up, 180 to the left, and 270 is down. So we can just take that same code and put it in here for the other ones. Sprite index W, that should say, oops, down. And I'm sorry, this is down. W is up. And we're not ready for the key release yet, but we will be doing that. So now, when I go different directions, he looks like he's going different directions. Can you see that? Sort of. Whoa, look at him go. Needs a little more obviousness, but not bad. Oh, there he goes. Now, we can't stop, so if that's Pac-Man, you can't stop in Pac-Man unless you hit a wall. You can't do a release, but some people want to do a key release and make the sprite a little more tame. Now, so we wanted to stop animating when we let go of the left, right, up, and down, WASD. So we're going to do, if keyboard check released, A. Um, there's several ways we could do this. I'm going to just set image speed equal to zero, um, which will work. But if I test this real quick, you'll see once you set it, it does set it. But then when I change any other direction, they're not animating anymore because I never changed image speed. So if you're going to use this method, you then also have to say, yeah, set the sprite, but also set your image speed. Yeah, I messed that up. Your image speed should be 1, which is a multiplier. 1 would be normal, not 15 that I originally had this at. So these are all set to 1, which is normal when you're pressing the key. And when you release, it gets turned into 0. So similarly, we just paste this and make 1 D, 1 a W, and 1 an S. And tidy up our code here. Put a gap there so it's easier to read. And test it out. Right, let go, left, let go, up, let go, down, let go. Looks good. Four directional movement with sprite changes and static. Very nice, very nice.